it's me. I'm back. You know, I was going to say something else, but I was focused on fixing this microphone because it won't stay. I'm back in the studio at my high school. I just had the best day ever. Um, we had our first Gay Straight Alliance meeting today, and it just went so great. I wanted to tell you guys all about it while still fresh in my mind. I wish I could do that for camp because, like, there's so much cool stuff that happens. I wish I could just record all of camp, but, you know... Photo agreements, can't do that. Anyways, so um, for like quite a while now, I've wanted to start a gay straight alliance. And now that I'm back in public school, I finally started one with my friend Timmy. And then we also teamed up with another guy named Noah. There was some drama, but we all got it figured out. He was starting one at the same time as us, <laughs> but we got it all figured out in the end. And um, we had our first meeting today and I wasn't expecting more than 10 people to show up. I was very, doubtful that we'd have enough people to keep the club going because you have to have a minimum of 10 people and I had to go get lunch first so I come down the hall and Noah runs to me and says Cole there's a full classroom and I was just like what <laughs> and I walked in there and I saw that there was like 20 people in there and I wanted to start crying because oh my god so many people and um we got our stuff sat down and started talking and as we talked more and more people came in and by the end of the meeting there was 34 people in that room counting a couple of teachers even and um it was so great we talked about rules had people sign confidentiality agreements it was fantastic and we made cookies and handed them out and it was beautiful and the best part was it felt like camp does like it felt almost exactly like a mini camp. It felt like home and God, I just, I am so glad that I started this now. And so many kids kept complimenting my outfit. Like this one boy, I didn't catch his name. He said that I walked in the room and he saw my outfit and he wanted to just hug me. So he hugged me when he told me that and just, I love these people so much. <laughs> And we're talking about discussions that we're going to do later on, and we have a whole calendar, and I, God, I'm just, huh, I'm so happy. I ended up doing so much in that one meeting that I didn't have time to eat, and I had to eat in science, which is my fourth hour. And I actually did so much that I actually lost a few things to do for the next meeting because I did them today instead. So I have to work on a schedule for next meeting on what we're going to talk about and stuff. And it's great. We did introductions like we do at camp, you know, um, name, PGP, age, and something about yourself. And it was just so great. So many kids were there just to support their friends. Um, not a single person said they just came for the cookies because we told, said on the announcements that there were going to be free cookies. So, yeah, it was amazing. And honestly, I was actually really surprised because on the photo agreement that I have for GSA, um, only two kids said that they would rather not be in pictures, which is like really great, which means I can post pictures of GSA online. So you guys will probably be seeing pictures pretty soon. Um, I just, I feel so good right now. Oh yeah, I also have a really great outfit on today. Like, look at this, look at this. My head is phasing out, but oh well. Camera view, green screen, you know, the works. I wonder if my flag would phase out. No, not green enough, sadly. Oh well, um, <laughs> I love filming in here so much. It's so much nicer than using my camera at home. Like just, yeah. So thanks Mr. Butler for letting me use the camera in here. I love you. I love this school, it's so great. But yeah, that is today. I'll keep you guys updated. See ya.